You are our vanguard. Uniforms, black suit with hip hop accents, fitted with a New York Yankees cap, more than a movement, more than a force. We call him the Godfather. Because, because before you came, we were silent. From the poets who pen before us to those who are not granted this privilege. DJ scratching turntables on their chins. MCs trading punchlines in alleyways. Anything, Anything just, just to, to get a hit. See, most of our leaders left, so we had to write with our right and left just to right the wrongs they left. Check, like kings in danger during chess. But you showed us that in this game, black could make the first move. What do you call a man who spun the brakes to make tradition and then penned a bestseller posted in the downward dog position? A flexible thinker. Vanguard? No. How about global, no pork vocal, New York local, loco, mocha, yoga mogul? <laughs> yoga mogul. <laughs> We're going with Vanguard. Vanguard. Vanguard! Like leading the troops, like we were traveling griots with broken guitar strings, couldn't follow the chop music, so we danced like machine guns and called it popping. And you once said, art allows people to dream their way out of struggle. So thank you for giving us music that fed our souls and defined a generation. For transforming barren city blocks into beautiful Broadway plays. We're hanging on nothing but billboards now. Finally figured out how to defy gravity and truly be fly. Using boomboxes like wings, listening to rock the bells, because we can never afford to rock bling. So from high top Nikes to Adidas with no strings You built a summit for the music, you signed the blueprint And then brought stillness to the movement If you are the peak and we're rushes you've made We don't live in your shadow, we grow in your shade Who else could fuse fashion and freestyle? Flip our style to Argyle All, All as a means of accomplishing our dreams. dreams So thank you for rope chains and baby fat models <laughs> The Beastie Boys for finally giving hope to thin limb schlamazels from the projects to the front office, and Ronald Reagan to Barack Obama. Your vision has paved the way for change, to use throats like megaphones and finally let this world know our names. So now we scream our words from the lines of the page so that deaf poetry no longer falls on deaf ears. Mr. Simmons, thank you for the stage.